how do you feel about you know some of the artists that came? I mean, do you think that there should have been more support from U.S. artists to come out here and kind of help burgeon this new rap scene going on? It's a great start because again, it's, it's just a start. So you're gonna see more people because it's sad, but niggas are groupies in essence with these industry niggas. They gotta see other motherfuckers doing it, then they wanna jump on the you know the train late. So I give more respect and love to the people that are here right now because they care the most. And you know, you, you get the energy, you see them taking time for the master classes and doing the panels and giving their input. So it don't matter who ain't here, it's about who's here. And watch next year, there'll be more niggas and there'll be dick riders and act like they've been down with it from day one. But fine, pimp them niggas. And, and they go to it, and they know what a, what a passport is. <laughs> right, 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 right. So that's, that's how I feel about cool. that. I love who's here, and I know most of the niggas is here. And them niggas is thorough. I don't just fuck with niggas because of who they are and who they feel like with. So pretty much everybody that came across on the planes and we getting it in, you know, we in the coffee shops and we drinking hella tough and, you know, we in a red light district, you know, surrounded by pizzles. They're my niggas. So they know so, what it is and it was real dude. So, you know, shouts out to all the cast that's here. Cool. Quick question about your album. Like, yes. uh, you know, regardless of detox, whether that comes or, or never comes, is that going to have anything to do with the release of your upcoming album? Absolutely not. Um, so we will see Bishop Lamont, regardless of Eminem, regardless of 50, regardless of Dre, we're going to see you. Them, them the big homies, they got nothing to do with my chamber. My, my thing is, is the beginning of a new movement. So that's been in the works for four years now on Aftermath. So it's finally time for that to come. So um, it's a blessing. And, and what I've created, um, I've given everything for my soul, for my life. So I just can't wait for people to, to receive it. And I appreciate the love of people being patient. So it's gonna be crazy. I'm not. I'm not worried about that. So your fourth I'm coming. I'm gonna do it all the money. I don't, your fourth coming out. Would you consider it <laughs> your best work that you've probably ever My done in your life? My best work I've ever done. And I had to have it that way. Um, everything on the album supersedes anything I've done with mixtapes. You know what I'm saying? And I want it to be that way. Each mixtape that I came out with. Um, showed my growth and showed my direction so everything catapulted to another level and the reformation is um, it encompasses every aspect of my life and my artistry and, and just what I'm trying to speak on and what my movement is so I'm really excited and I'm, I'm my own worst critic so for me to really like what I'm doing mm -hmm. it's gotta be some crazy shit a nigga that lost weight and gained weight got buff doing this shit for this album so I yeah. put everything into it. It's a, it's a home cooked meal. There's no fast food rap. You know, a nigga got in the kitchen and Chef Boy RD did and really put something together for the world to enjoy. So, you know. Has, has working with a producer as big as Dr. Dre, has it dwarfed your perception of other producers? Does it does Not it make no. you compare in any type Not of way? No. Like, you've Not worked no. with the best. Like, Not what's no. it like to get in the, in the studio with new producers? I mean, is there any type of, you know, comparison that you do? Well, there you is know. no comparison because Dr. Dre is Dr. Dre. But high tech is high tech. Jay Dilla is Jay Dilla. DJ Quick is DJ Quick. Battle Cat. You know what I'm saying? So Focus, Khalil, you know what I'm saying? Lord Finesse. Them names speak volumes in themselves. So I never compare or contrast anything. You know what I'm saying? Contrast anything because them niggas is all epic and mega in their own, you know what I'm saying? Right. And it's just a, a, a again, plethora of sound and technique. You know what I'm saying? It's just lovely. I'm excited. Um, Knife Wonder, you know what I'm saying? Um, it's just amazing what we have for the album. Um, I, I, I'm a fan of my own shit. It's sad to say, but I really like what the fuck I did. And I don't say that much. <laughs> I don't toot my own horn, but right now, nigga Dizzy Gillespie right now with his shit. So, yeah.